Hey, what's up guys? I just wanted to make another video uh, talking about uh, another set of symptoms that I get from my last concussion, which is, well, and the previous concussion. But uh, that kind of, that category of symptoms is basically uh, my spatial awareness and I guess I'll throw in my, my proprioception as well, which is like my sense of where my body is in space. And so, some one thing that happens is like, when the inflammation is worse or when my symptoms are worse, like they're kind of, I feel these symptoms a lot right now. And that is like, I can't, I can't really sense where things are and so like when I'm walking around, especially in like close, tight um, spaces, I have to like have my hand out to like feel where things are or, or else like I might bump my head again or it's just hard to tell where things are. Um, and that's even with like my eyes open. And another symptom is that um, like when I close my eyes, like usually, um, like before my concussions, like you close your eyes and like say you were in a room and you're trying to like walk with your eyes closed and you can kind of, you can kind of sense where things are or at least you, your brain can still kind of feel where things are even though you can't see them. But that got affected with my concussions as well and that that kind of happened when I hit my head right here which is that kind of vestibular um, part of your brain but yeah so basically like when I close my eyes it's like everything disappears and I can't it just feels like there's nothing and it's it's like it's a really scary feeling it's very anxiety provoking and it makes you feel super uncomfortable and not grounded because you just feel like you're not anywhere and it, that's really scary it, it's like you're floating in space with nothing around you and it's not that's not very fun and even another symptom that's basically in that same realm is like like right now I'm in a space where I can't really see outside of where I am and so what happens is like um, my brain can't pick up or create that map or create a grid outside of what I can see which yeah it's like basically the same thing um, and so, what I can't, like everything I can't see, it feels like nothing else exists. It feels like I'm in space, or like it's just blackness, which is super scary, because it, it makes you just feel so uncomfortable, because you, you don't feel like you're, you don't know where north is, you don't know where south is, you don't know where anything is. And so it just makes everything feel super closed in on you and it's really very, very uncomfortable. Um, and yeah, and that's just from the concussions. Like I got hit here and that caused some of the symptoms and then I got hit in the back of my head and that caused some more of those symptoms. And then another side of that is not only being able to sense where space outside of me is, but also my sense of where my bodies are or my, my bodies, because I have multiple bodies. Uh, my sense of where my body parts are, especially like my head and my arms and my legs. So it's just like, sometimes I can't sense very well that my legs are there. And so it'll feel like I'm kind of just floating. Um, and it's not like, this is from the concussions, I've, like, it wasn't happening before the concussions, and, 
but it's like my legs will feel like they're kind of disappearing or my arms will feel like they're I can't sense where my arms are so I'm like always kind of like what I do is like I pull I'm always like pulling my arms in because it's like my I'm trying to like acquire feeling them but it's like it doesn't work because like I I just can't sense where they are and I guess we'll like wearing gloves and wearing long sleeves kind of helps a little bit because it just kind of it it activates your brain like it tells your brain like you have limbs <laughs> which it's really weird um, yeah and so that's another subset of symptoms that I experience um, I'm sure there's more subtleties and more um, specific things that I experienced also related to that but that's kind of just what I can remember is like it's super hard sometimes to sense where everything is around me even with my eyes open and then even with my eyes closed and so sometimes it's like I get really scared that I'm gonna hit my head again because I can't feel where things are so I'm just kind of like walking like around slowly and my head is like down because I can't I can't feel where the ceiling is I can't feel where things are so it's just like it's scary because my head is already vulnerable I've got I barely hit my head to have uh, some effects of the concussion and so not being able to sense where things are and where you are makes it worse because it's like you just feel like you're kind of trapped like every everything's coming out your head it's like ugh. but yeah I just wanted to make another video about that symptom it goes up and down sometimes I don't feel those symptoms at all and it is all um, because of my digestive system when the inflammation is active then I feel them or feel those symptoms when the inflammation is not active either by taking a bunch of probiotics or eating certain foods or not eating certain foods um, then I don't feel those symptoms and so just working on fixing that root problem, which is my gut. Um, and yeah, so I just want to make this video. And yeah. Peace.